Hello and welcome. My name is Tom the Toolman and I am the CEO at thetoolman.net. Uh, today we're going to go over how to brand your rebrandable software from your free software club. Okay. Now uh, what we have here is a, a, pa a wrapper package to be able to package more than one download into one utility instead of giving a whole bunch of zip files. Okay. So how this works is you get to piece that you want to extract from the from the software and you get it up in the window and you click activate. Now there you'll see header rebrander. Okay. So now we come down here and we will extract a piece to rebrand. I uh, come over to SWM Pro, click on activate, and here you see all the files that you need for the software. You simply highlight them all and you copy them and you put them into a folder where you can locate them on your computer. As you see here I have made a test brand folder for this and we just click here it files empty so we paste our files in there. Now as they as they paste in there you will see them appear as soon as my computer will stop hanging up. And there we have all the files we need pasted to our computer. Now you will go back over to the brander and here you have the brander. Now in order to figure out what piece of software the brander is going to brand you go to file and then go to open and you will search through your computer to get the software. Now as you see we're here viral software club and then test brand. So we come over here to test brand and it will only show you the files that are compatible with the brander. So if you're in the wrong file nothing's going to show up to rebrand. Okay. So now before we get to the branding I want to show you here we'll click on the file the software in the file to show you the header that's in there now. Okay there's the header right there that's in there now. All right. Now we're going to close this and we're going to go over and open up the brander and we're going to open the software into the brander. Now there is the URL for the web header and I've got one made for testheader.html. So now once you have that up in there you simply click rebrand and it says output file successfully created. Okay so now we just put the header rebrander back behind the window and now this is the software that we just rebranded okay viral software club test brand all right now click on the software and you'll see a different header okay there's the header right there all right a different header it doesn't fit in the spot because I made this just for a test for one of my clients that's having a hard time and I will do the same for anybody else who has a hard time I will give you an instructional video to where you will be able to do everything step by step have no doubt that you're doing it correctly okay so I appreciate you taking the time to watch this video this is Tom the Toolman CEO at thetoolman.net signing off